the smell of Hobby Lobby in the morning. Oh God. That's terrifying. All sold out. All right, I need to speak with the manager. Okay, we're in Colombia now. We have to wear face masks here. My glasses are foggy. <laughs> Pinson. No way. Chuck Pinson. They have two Pinson. He is it. And cat. it is 40% off. Oh. Okay, let's go. everyone, Crafts with Crashly here. I have an exciting unboxing, as I'm sure you just saw at the intro of the video. <laughs> so yes, Hobby Lobby is now carrying Diamond R Clubs. It's true. I got one. I actually got two to be exact. It took me going to two different Hobby Lobbies because just because the first one I went to, they were sold out. I could see the little pegs that said DAC on it and I was like, argh. Yeah, and I even asked the Hobby Lobby worker if they had any more at back. And I just asked them, hey, do you have any more of these diamond art club diamond paintings out back? They said, the what? All of our diamond paintings are up here. And they had a couple of the regular diamond dots ones. They didn't even know what diamond art club was. And I was like, oh my gosh, please stand still while I punch you in the face. Anyway, <laughs> the same thing happened at the next Hobby Lobby. I asked if there was any more options and yeah, they didn't know what it was either. Anyway, so I did buy two of these. So when I went there, they had a few that were sold out, but they did have this one, which of course is Sneaky Cat by Eve Izet, 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 I don't know, but we'll go over that. So they had Sneaky Cat and they did have Chuck Pinson. So it's not a rumor. It's not a dream that you had last week. It is true. They had two different options of Chuck Pinson's. I did buy one of them. Um, I think it's called like uh, Dreams of Reflect, Hopes of Reflect, something about reflections. I don't know, it's about some cabin. I did a giveaway for it in my last Sunday social. So um, yeah, it's over there yonder. I'm going to be unboxing this one. So as far as I can see, the box looks a little bit different, um, but the regular price on these paintings and the same thing with the Chuck was $59.99. But as most of us know, we can get a Hobby Lobby coupon of 40%. These were actually already on sale for 40%, which isn't that big of a deal because we all have access to the coupon. So yeah, I got this for like 36 bucks. And you can't beat that, you guys. Plus, I don't have to wait for shipping or anything like that. It's amazing. So this is Sneaky Cat. It is a square drill, as we can tell right here by this little square image. And it is 52 by 107. So you guys, a diamond painting of this quality for like $36. And this size is absolutely crazy and unheard of. I'm so excited that Diamond Art Club decided to do this. Um, I'm kind of curious how the image releases are going to go. I plan on messaging them and asking them. Um, Hobby Lobby did tell me they get a truck on Mondays, so I don't know how it's going to work with different images or what's going to go on. So, But I can tell you, at my Hobby Lobby, well, the second one I went to, they had Chuck Pinson's and they had Sneaky Cat. So let's go ahead and unbox this. So like I said, the, the box itself looks to be a little bit different. Let me just zoom you out a little bit here. Oh, that's a lamp. So it looks like the image like wraps around, which I think is so freaking cool. And then of course, 
you have your thumbnail image here on the side. Focus it. Then you have the thumbnail image here on the box right there. And this is what the other side is. Just tells you the tool kit. And then on the back you have the kit contents. And a couple of picture instructions, I guess. So yeah, let's go ahead and jump into it here. So I have been wanting this painting since I saw Mickey Sunshine do it. So it's absolutely massive, but it's totally pretty. So let's open it. I'm curious if the inside is going to be any different. Here it comes, okay. Man, this sucker is huge. Uh, is there anything else in here? Oh, it's way down deep in that. Let me just, I'm going in. Oh my God, let me just put my whole arm in here. Here we go, here we go. Now we're getting somewhere. Okay, let's see what all we got in here. So, I'm gonna bring you closer real quick. We got warranty and insurance card. What? Diamond Art Club designs and assembles the highest quality diamond art painting, gives you the best quality. Uh, there are rare occasions, however, when minor problems such as diamond shortages or an accidental spill occur and you simply ha need help finishing the project. So we're here to help. Uh, it says register your product within 30 days of purchase to activate the following. Lifetime warranty against defects in materials and workmanship. Hmm. Defects in workmanship. Let's think about that. So if I stab it with a knife, I'm just kidding. We're not going to talk about that. <laughs> I would never... So, accidental, oops, insurance to replace up to eight different diamond colors. Okay, so they'll replace up to eight, you guys. Up to eight. Exclusive Diamond Art Club offers and perks. Hmm. Hmm. So, wait. Exclusive Diamond Art Club offers and perks. So, I'm actually kind of curious now because, you know, we all know Diamond Art Club has their, you know, reward program. So I was wondering if we bought these at Hobby Lobby, if we would still get rewards. So I'm curious if that's what it means. Exclusive Diamond Art Club offers and perks. I want you to register. I don't know. I'll have to look into that and I will let everyone know. So they do send us these stickers and I could tell this sticker was newly printed because it has their largest, larger font, like the larger stickers, which fits perfectly on containers. I don't have any next to me right now, but much larger. No crazy symbols. There's 40 different colors it looks like. Ooh, and there's a bees boo It's 107 by 52. Holy bejesus, that's a big old kitty. I don't know how I feeling about that. <laughs> Oh, look, we got the little sticker. I love the little stickers. Peel sticker here. Use it to organize your stashed kits. Place it in your logbook or anywhere you'd like. Aw, they're so sweet. Yeah, and this, for those of you who don't know, this is also a sticker. Like, you could peel this off. What most of us, I think, like to do. See, sticker. Or what I do, anyway, is I cut out each of these little strips. And then I put them on my container. So I have a Harbor Freight container. These are not Diamond Art Club labels, but something like this. So you could, like, you know, cut these out into strips and put them on your containers just to help you organize your drills and kit up your projects. So that's cool. And this you can even put on the top of a container to let you know, or like it said, put it in a logbook. So here's the tool kit. I'm not going to spend too much time on it because we all know, well, most of us knows what comes in these tool kits. But for those of you who are thinking about starting to diamond paint and you have a local Hobby Lobby, here you go. So you get your standard blue drill pin. Okay, this is a single placer. And then you get the tweezers of death. Yes, they are sharp. Yes, they could probably kill a deer or an elephant or a lion. Anyway, and then these are a couple of baggies you can put extra drills in. They give you two heart waxes, which goes in the tip of the pins to help you pick up the drills. You get a grippy squisher majigger thingy. I don't know what you call it. It goes right here on the pin for comfort. Why is this harder to do than I imagined it being? Oh, you just gotta, you just gotta give a little twist, you know? Get, show it some compassion and some love. 
or show it who's boss, whatever. So sometimes they send you a multi-placer. Unless I missed it, I'm not seeing one. But that's okay. So you got your single tip, standard blue pen. So some people like to place their diamonds or their drills on the canvases with tweezers. Some like to use pens. I enjoy pens. Okay, let's put the stuff back. And this is the boat that you put the diamonds in. You give them a little shake, line them up. So that is the toolkit. Let me just close this up. And we'll get into the canvas. So, so far this looks like their regular packaging. Diamond Art Club is right on the, pla the plastic here. Let's open her up, boy boy. So I don't think this whole diamond painting is going to be able to go on my desk to where you can see it all. But I'm just going to lay it over everything and then at the end of the video, I will spread it out like on my bed or something and then do a close up picture so you can see the whole thing laid out. Oh my gosh, look at this you guys. So if you haven't tried Diamond Art Club yet, because I don't know, they're more expensive or they're sold out of something, I strongly encourage you to go to your local Hobby Lobby and see if you, like, look at this quality. I'm, I'm gonna zoom you in. We're gonna take these drills out first, but you just, you haven't seen anything like this, I assure you. So we get two packages of drills. Oh look, step-by-step -step instructions. I was wondering if this told me about the rewards. You made our day. We hope you, we hope we made yours. Enjoy your diamond art tip. As you channel your creativity. Love it if you share your finished artwork with us. All right, so you have step-by-step -step instructions. Ooh, what is this? Ooh, and a 10% off your next purchase. There you go. Couple tips and tricks for ya. Well, that's cool. Okay. Hey. No, well, that's about it. All right. Nothing about the rewards, but that's okay. I plan on asking them and I'll let you guys know. So yeah, I'm not going to be able <laughs> to get all of this on the video right here. But just so you guys could see, <laughs> that is one big kitty. Like these eyes are like, completely staring in the depths of my soul but for those new diamond painters who haven't tried diamond art club i'm just going to try to zoom you in here as much as i can just so you can just get an idea of this clarity like the bold colors throughout the entire canvas like look at look at how much these pop out my goodness oh this diamond painting is stunning that's a lot of colors. And there's no crazy symbols. And this is also poured glue, y'all, if you didn't know that. Because I know I'm mainly focusing on brand new diamond paintings, like referring to brand new diamond painters. But poured glue, if you haven't tried that before, that's like a whole new world. Like, that's a game changer. A whole new world. Yeah, seriously. <laughs> Your drills, like... You don't have to go work out for 20 minutes to buff your biceps up to move a drill around. It slides like smooth velvet. It's amazing. Plus the adhesive with poured glue lasts forever. There's no need to seal. You can just hang it out the way it is. You don't have to worry about your drills falling off or anything. Not only that, but the back of these canvases, oh my gosh, they are like velvety smooth. Like, I remember the first time I opened my first, or yeah, the first time I got a Diamond Art Club. That's crazy. Like, most of you will be used to, like, AliExpress diamond paintings or some that you get from Amazon, where they're, like, papery and cardboard feeling, you know? This is completely different. This is incredible. And the fact that they're at Hobby Lobby now, again, complete game changer. So, I'm going to go ahead. Oh, and another thing, too. Here's the end of this. So you do have another key here and on the other side at the bottom you have one here as well so that's really cool along with that all diamond art clubs artists are licensed meaning they this is all original work you shouldn't be able to find these images anywhere else so at the bottom of each canvas oof, there we go you can see the name of the actual painting and the artist 
Eve, IZ, IZ, whatever. The size and everything. And you got another thumbnail there. So yeah, they they really are an incredible company. It, and not only that, but they listen to their customers. That's like one of my favorite parts about them. I'm trying to try to get the camera zoom. There we go, our focus. They really listen to their customers too. They've done nothing but get even better, especially like when you don't even think it's possible. So I'm gonna go ahead and flip this over real quick. Okay, so now we're looking at the back of the canvas. This is massive, y'all, oh my gosh. I know the perfect place to hang this too. <laughs> we're gonna look at these drills. So as you can see, all of these kits come with everything that you need, right? So, so far, the Diamond Art Club reputation came with it to Hobby Lobby. So we're gonna go ahead and take a closer look at these drills. This might be loud when I open them, but we'll look at each color. So I'm just gonna kinda pause the video here so you don't have to hear the crinkling, and I'll be right back. All right, so let's look at each individual color here. So we have a couple nine, three nines, and again, this is a square drill diamond painting. So what that means, <laughs> you guys know if you've gotten like cheaper diamond painting kits from AliExpress or from Amazon, you know, the quality of the squares usually aren't there. There's usually lots of tags. So Diamond Art Club has made incredible improvements on their drill quality. I've done various square drill diamond painting kits from them and their drills are better than ever moments in my opinion. Way less trash in one of these kits than I do with Ever Moment. Got some purples in there. We got two of these purples. 155. These are the DMCs. 208. 3024. Got like a cream color there. Ooh. Oh man. These, this is one of my favorite DMCs right here. Oh look, there's three of them! Oh my gosh. 823, 823, 823. More purple. But just look at these drill quality. Like, look at this. Look at it. Do you even see any with any tags? I'm looking. Oh, there's one right there with a the little nub. <laughs> well, that's unavoidable. I think most of us already know that. Okay, we should be getting to some AGs here soon. Oh, look, here's one right now. All right, so let's zoom. Oh, that's upside down, hold on. We gotta start from the other end or I'll go absolutely insane. There we go. Okay, so there's some green, these are not ABs. Sorry about that, hold on, I'm gonna adjust this. Okay, so we got 699, like a dark green color. Holy orange or pink, geez, that's a bright color. 606. 498, 742, 3846. Oh, I am loving these colors. Here is an AB. Oh, an AB orange. Look at that. So, hopefully, you can tell the difference between these. Let me try to refocus here. There we go. So, you see how, like, the, what do you call it, like a matte face? versus like this metallic. These are ABs or Aurora Borealis. So we have some orange ABs. There's regular white. Regular 740. Ooh, like a plum color. 519. 48. Oh my gosh. <laughs> it's another one. Holy green. Oh my gosh. Hold on, where'd that orange go? Look at it. Oh my gosh. Power of the colorful diamonds. <laughs> that is amazing. So we got 134, 905, 917, 3325, 820. Ooh, there's so many different colors. Oh my god, it's another one. <laughs> One, three, eight, a really, really pretty blue one. Oh my gosh. I am obsessed, but yes, now I do have to line them all up in case you're wondering. Where's the orange? Where's the orange? Orange, 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 orange. Look at it. Oh, oh 
that is so pretty. Okay, let me put these over here now. We have two, we have a bunch of 209s. Holy moly, these are the big bags. 798. Wait, is that 796? My bad. 995. Ooh, that's another pretty. Oh, lots of purple. Oh, 310s. Oh, gosh, I am so excited to lay down 310s. You have no idea. Sorry, Kazan. Ooh. Ooh, another little purpley pinky. Purple pinky. Ooh, there's a lot of those. All right, 210. Yep. You have, uh, what is that? 3844. Four. Two bags of those. All right. Lots, lots of different colors. This one's going to be fun to do. I like the vibrancy of all the colors. <laughs> there's a lot of them. But yeah, this is going to be a lot of fun. So there's three ABs, it looks like. So that's going to be the top three symbols. So it's the one, three, two, the orange, the green, and the blue. Usually the first couple listed in the key are the ABs. I'm pretty sure anyway. <laughs> Last few kids I've done, that's how it's been. But yes, this is going to be amazing to do. Check out your local Hobby Lobby. Comment below which ones you purchased already or which ones you found. I'm curious to see if they're going to be getting any different images. So again, when I was there, they had two different Chuck Pensons, Sneaky Cat, I can't really remember the rest because they were sold out. So I didn't pay attention or didn't say it, I don't remember. But yeah, let me know which ones that you find. And yeah, put the names in too so we know. I'm just, I'm curious if they're gonna get the new images frequently. Um, and I will ask about that rewards program and I will let you guys know. Um, just to see if we get credit or points for purchasing these from Hobby Lobby on their website with their rewards program. So more to come on that. That will be in a separate video. But yeah, um, stay tuned and I'm going to go ahead and lay out the canvas on my bed and take a quick little snippet video so you can see it all laid out. But thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed it and you haven't already, please subscribe so you don't miss anything else. And yeah, hit your thumbs up on the way out, oh, you know, you know. <laughs> All right, everyone, until next time, bye.